Hello guys, good morning, um, grade 10, and now we're back in our Kumpla with Workplace Hygiene. And last time, I stopped talking about here in Workplace Hygiene Procedures. And Workplace Hygiene Procedures are practices used to control and safety of food making, fit for human consumption, or safe to eat. Okay, so um, guys, please finish the previous um, videos, and yes, you can proceed in this one and yep assignments and oh yes and homeworks will follow soon and now i'll just um recap this um slide then we will proceed so always comply with legislated requirements or with the law always follow house policies and procedures your workplace um rules and policies Always adhere to house requirements where they differ to the notes. So you always um, analyze or um, think of the house requirements because sometimes there's different, but of course you need to understand it as well. Okay, so because following, you need always to follow as a worker or as a manager or someone else in the company because it's not only for you it's also for the company and for everyone else. So it's a win-win situation where in all of you are benefited or in good, in good, um, what is this? All in good terms. Okay, so that's it. I will be proceeding to the next slide. So now we will be talking about standards or requirements applying to workplace hygiene procedures. Okay, still for about um, hygiene procedures. So potentially hazardous food or dangerous food. Okay, so now we'll be talking about potentially or possible dangerous food. So food must be stored out of the temperature danger zone. So you must store or place the food out of temperature danger zone. What is this temperature danger zone? It is between 5 degrees to 60 degrees Celsius. This because in this um, uh, temperature, bacteria in the food spread rapidly. Okay? If you don't um, store them in the right temperature, your food will be contaminated with bacteria immediately okay it can cause um diarrhea or sickness which is not good of course we will have a guest complaint also in this um temperature is where they spread fast okay so bacteria is spread fast in your food because it's of some ingredients of course um it get easily spoiled so whenever you store your food even at your house that's why you notice your your food if you just put it in the table it gets easily um tastes not good or easily uh what is this spoiled yeah it gets easily spoiled but if you store it in a cooler place like fridge or yes in fridge you will notice that your food will last longer because the temperature in the fridge is lower than five degrees okay and our normal temperature here in Phnom Penh or your house or room temperature it could be like around 20 degrees or 30 degrees so it's still in temperature danger zone so be careful when storing food we must not put them um, too long in this temperature danger zone as much as possible. Possible, we must um, go exit beyond it. Like if you want to eat food, you must boil it or heat it. You must heat it and above sixty degrees so that the bacteria will die. Okay, so there is also a time where you can put your food on. Next. Okay, so I have a few seconds left, so yes, I'll continue later.